after injury, I don't have anything. I always stay home. Hard to going out, talking any new people. I wanna my life busy. So now I start shooting. <laughs> my life now is better. I enjoy my life now. My name is Kiranji Singh. I am para sports shooter. My goal is going Olympic. But this year in the competition championship, I need to score six to four to qualify. Yeah, this is this is my first time. This is my first time going to shooting. This is my first shot and. First, second, second and yeah. third. Third. <laughs> to bullshot. Bullshot. I have spinal cord injury C4, C5. After accident, nothing arm, nothing finger, nothing. I always watch some videos with oh. coffee and eat. Okay. I watch some Indian blogs to see some Indian culture, tractor. Before accident, I drive tractor, truck, everything. But I driving tractor, I like it. India, I, like, I'm 10 year old. I start driving tractor there. <laughs> he's really very nice person and he's really caring husband, <laughs> yeah. Before his accident, he was doing all jobs, even give me support in every work, in household, outside, gardening, everything. He's an understanding husband. <laughs> we met, like, arranged marriage. So it's not a love marriage, like, you already choose one, so you can meet so many people, like, who is the best for you. We had a half an hour talk, then he asked about my choices, my studies, and what works you can do. Can you cook? Can you? Like these sort of things he was asking. I was keep quiet and thinking, if he choose to marry me, after marriage, I will <laughs> show him my real color. Then I asked about his choices. His parents decided, oh, okay, fine. So he's going to marry me, and after 10 days, we got married. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'm very happy. She always supports me. Everything she look after me. After married one year, I decide to come to New Zealand to settle their better life. And I come here and driving truck and tractor, is packing the cauliflower, broccoli. I working six day. And Sunday, I was playing cricket every week. We were just focusing on our careers, setting up here, buy a home. But we had no idea, accident, everything will be changed. It was a Thursday, I think, 10th of March, 2016. And uh, normally, he comes in some months late, like around 8.30 from work. That time I work there in the evening. I nearly finish time around 7 o'clock. I unload the pumpkin harvester, but it's faulty harvester. I don't know. Nobody tell me, my boss or my manager. He one rod off the belt, the heavy rod, round 100 kg. He hit in the neck. I don't know what happened to my body, but I in the floor, lying dull. Then I was just waiting him. He didn't come, and I called him. 
my phone is ringing so you know my arm is not moving so i just waited 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 and it's nine o'clock then i start worrying so i was just thinking maybe i could call his friends but i was shy then finally i made courage to message one of his friend's wife is your husband home or still at work then she said my husband is home then she said why are you asking i said kiranjit is not home and please ask your husband where is he he said he has no idea is evening is the dark there alone maybe i think that time i died there then i had to call your boss and ask where he sent him to work finally they tracked him through gps king seed area in a farm 11 o'clock uh, she find me is ambulance coming there because uh, when his friend reached there so i called them and i request them to please i want to talk to him and they gave him phone so he talked to me because i want to hear his voice he said i'm fine don't worry i have small accident going to hospital i think after accident only i'm moving my neck nothing arm nothing finger nothing yeah it's very hard intense recovery you know i stay 3 month in the hospital uh, exercise cuz slowly slowly recovering because first 3 months he just working to how he can drive his wheelchair focusing on his balance how he can say and then he had surgery after 6 months like gave him some function to open his hand every year lot of surgery after year is my twice surgery i'm moving my arm before my arm she, my wife give me two year feeding i never feeding myself and slowly slowly a lot of hard work and my family support my mom dad and after that i am now here <laughs> This is very tasty. <laughs> nice. I like it. I decide after injury I don't have anything. I always stay home. I want my life busy. That's why I start to going out and start shooting. I like shooting before accident, but I'm busy with the work course. I'm not. I have not had time. Only I am coming to some training. You come more practice, learning new things, to some good aim. Day I start shooting. My shot is very good. He has a bullseye, so like it was really so. Na- it's natural aim. After second day, better to better. Oh, after I just decide to na I wanna go continue my shooting. My goal is going Olympic to gold medal. I believe in the God. I lot of prayer in the hospital. Please save my life. Yeah, God give me the second chance. I better. That's why I decide to follow my religion. Cause two things there. Some follow, put on the turban, make beer, no smoke, no meat, no egg, no fish, no alcohol. go to in the temple female has only one style like they tie the mala on different style up to them how they like 
before accident i do it lot of style to make the chavan mm. was is now sometimes hard to hold mm. to she help me to but i like this style now ਮਾਰੇ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਇਧਰ ਨੂੰ ਹਾਂ ਹਾਂ ਇਹ ਕਿ ਚਿੱਕ ਚੀਚੀਆਂ ਨਾ ਮੇਰਾ ਮੂੰਹ ਲਾਲ ਕਰ ਬਿਫੋਰ ਹਿਸ ਐਕਸੀਡੈਂਟ ਵੀ ਯੂਜ਼ ਟੂ ਗੋ ਏਵਰੀ ਸੈਟਰਡੇ ਐਂਡ ਸੰਡੇ ਮਾਰਨਿੰਗ ਬਟ ਹਿਸ ਐਕਸੀਡੈਂਟ ਹੀ ਡੋਨਟ ਲਾਈਕ ਟੂ ਗੋ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਲਿਟ ਸ਼ਾਈ ਟੂ ਗੋ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਪੀਪਲ ਇਨ ਦਾ ਟੈਂਪਲ ਦੇ ਮਾਈ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ question ask me how when you accident you stay in wheelchair lot of question that's why i decide to better go to my weekday people start coming around 10 and start feeling then they finish 1 o'clock prayers everything then and they have this, food like, don't stay like <laughs> free then, food yeah <laughs> This is the model of uh, the holy temple in Punjab. The holy water is thing like uh, is few hundreds year ago back and uh, there is a pond and uh, there is a person who was disabled and he has a like a disease that like uh, contagious disease so people avoided him and throw him away from the village. and one day he saw a black cross coming and dipping into the water and turning into white then he dipped his finger it is saw his like the sea is getting away because he has a skin disease and uh, oh, then he dipped himself in the water and he cured last time i'm going india before accident 2014 I miss there. Before accident, every two year going visit my family and friends in India. Hello. Hello. इन्हने काल का नहीं दो कमेंट ना आ रहा। बस ये नॉर्मल होने तो सीखा नहीं थे आगे। My dad is government service and police officer. डूटी तो काल के जाना होने थे ना? He have now retired. This organized party everything. my friends and my relative going but i not going he never traveled after his injury there has lot of problems of accessibility because india is not a wheelchair accessible country when after his accident he's shy but maybe he will get strong when we go <laughs> okay bye Coming on live 10 seconds. Go working. I am right now at Spinal Junior you know, Rehab Fitness Class. Every Wednesday come here 5 to 6. Yeah. And change. <laughs> Look where you going? Look where you going? Hi, we are hard journey. Like spending maximum time in hospitals and surgeries and rehab so now he overcome all surgeries and still focusing on to achieve his strength so he can get independent as much as he can 3 2 1 go elbows 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 begin there breathe this is my coach michael johnson He always teach me is new things. He's very good coach. Yeah, I saw the picture. Oh, I wanna judge you the shooting to sports. That's why I decide to shoot. Today he shot one zero six point two. No, you need to get internationally qualified. <laughs> so we can't get it. So I've known Kendrick for about a year now. He's got that. calm demeanor he's 
always looking to strive to be the best, and he's just got a bit of a natural raw talent. So yeah, if he keeps going the way he's going, you know, he's definitely got huge potential. I'm blind to Jefferson Park. Okay, I'm going to sit down He's come along with his wife. They make a, a great team, and especially in our classification SH2s, you are a team. So as a loader, it's responsibility to make things ready for him. And I does all the things like setup of the gun and filling the air, whatever he needs, adjustment. So it's a loader's responsibility to set everything for him. Yeah, communicate. Yeah, if we, like depend like. So he communicate where he want exactly his position is. So he will tell me where he want his chair, like, just let me know what to do. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> with experience, like, maybe it's our understanding, uh, yeah, because I am with him as a wife, so maybe I can understand what he's going to say now. I enjoying as a lord. I like to stay with him and to motivate him and support him. I'm just going to test the overlap on your jacket. Are you okay if I just touch your arms and shoulders? Other checks will Today is practice for new competition for me. I'm a little nervous. Yeah. It's the first time I participate in this competition. So the competition is the New Zealand Grand Prix, and it's actually the first time it's ever been run in New Zealand. And it's a, an amazing opportunity for our shooters to gain minimum qualifying scores towards Paris 2024 Paralympic Games. The big significance about it being the first time in New Zealand is our athletes don't have to go overseas to get their qualifying scores. I give my best shot and yeah, score going higher, yes. I want to see him go to Olympics and get some medals. That goal is far away, a lot of hard work. I have full trust in him. So I say, you can one day win it, so just keep it. I am here today competition, SH2 prone. My second competition, this one. It's a new experience every time. Very excited. I'm thinking to my aim today. 100% focused. In the sport of air rifle target shooting, you shoot 60 match shots. At the end of your 60 shots, the top eight shooters go through to a final, and that's where they shoot off for the best shooter. 30 seconds. The next lowest shooter gets eliminated until at the end, you're shooting for gold and silver. Match fired. Start. The perfect shot is a 10.9. The next shot down is a 10.8 and it's divided by a quarter of a millimeter. So you can win or lose the gold medal by a quarter of a millimeter at 10 meters. The qualities for a good shooter, you need to be really patient and you need to be a little bit pedantic, making sure everything's perfect, your equipment set up perfectly, your rifle set up perfectly, so you're always achieving for the unachievable, really. You can't get stressed out if you shoot a nine or a low 10. You've just got to keep going. Honestly, very nervous. <laughs> My heart is beating like this. I think both ways, loader as a wife. Even I'm also feeling a little bit nervous with his every shot, how it's going to be well or no. Yeah, that like same like what he feels. Maybe I'm feeling the same. First shot going nine there. 9.6 or 2, my heartbeat going start after, no, I focus my aim. Karen Jeet and Bian, they work together like peas in a pod. Karen Jeet, he's very calm, and Bian, she's 
a real go-getter, so if things need to be done, she's all over it, she's sorting it. So, yeah, they make a, a formidable force. They need to score 6-2 to qualify Olympic. Sometimes feeling eyes tired, like close my eyes and breathing, relax my mind after going start again my shot. On day seven, we have Kirinjit Singh, who is qualified in second place with a score of 6 of 25 decimal 2. It was so cool seeing Kieran Jeet come up from fourth up to second position. He was just shooting amazing shots. <laughs> He'll be on people's radars now, you know. The, they can see what he can shoot and uh, where he could possibly go in the future. So. I'm very excited today. My score is good now. <laughs> he <can't Yeah>. fight. <laughs> I'm qualified today. Yeah, I feel better. I start to enjoy my life now. I am happy now. Somebody see me to have a look what happened for me. I decide to go in to now go India. Spend my family. I see my friend. This is my clothes. The other bag is my ramp. And this is my gun case. I take to my sports gun and shoot there and practice. I'm excited, but a little nervous. If he the trip went very well, maybe we're hoping we frequently travel to India and visit family there. I'm thinking to my future, to plan my family. Now maybe everything is over, his rehab over, he's better and getting independent. I hope this is time for us to think about a family. After injury, almost now six years, my life now is better. I enjoy to something like new, feeling happy and better there.